Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather with meteorologist Ben Frischette. Well, this time yesterday, we were talking about how mild it feels for this time of yeah, year, yeah, and we the were. script has sort of flipped this morning. Sort of a chilly start. We're right? shivering now. I know, I know. It's like Mother Nature heard you too. Yeah. I'm like, oh yeah, it's almost winter. Better bring back the teens and twenties. Don't put it on us. <laughs> wow, okay, that's not what I meant. But, uh, it always comes back to the weather guy, doesn't it? It does. It does. Oh, uh, that's all right. Uh, <laughs> thankfully, the cold weather won't last very long. We actually have a very mild day on the way for tomorrow, and we'll talk about that in just a few minutes. Do want to start you off with the temperatures where they stand this morning. Teens in the Northeast Kingdom, low and mid 20s for basically everywhere else. But if you look across the Northeast and into the Midwest, you sort of get a preview of what's on the way for tomorrow. I mean, right now it's 54 in Chicago, almost 50 in Indianapolis. That is some of the warm air that is on the way for tomorrow. It's uh, all up after this leading edge of the warm front, which is producing some rain in the Great Lakes. But by the time that gets over here, I think it produces rain and snow. But that doesn't happen until the evening. Just know that most of your Wednesday will be dry, just sort of cloudy with a few breaks of sun. Temperatures getting into the 40s as a south wind starts to pick up. But as we think about the evening, that's when stuff gets a little bit dicey. And you'll see that here on Futurecast. A little bit of rain and snow in northern New York by about 2-3 o'clock today. And this band gets to the Champlain Valley as we think about 6, 7 o'clock tonight. I think it flips to rain pretty fast, so travel impacts in the valley, not expected to be widespread. But the cold air lingers a little longer in eastern Vermont. It could amount to a couple inches of wet snow, perhaps a little bit of freezing rain. But everybody goes over to plain rain tomorrow. And most of your Thursday, I think when you add up all the hours, is dry. Just know you'll find some passing showers throughout the day. Gusty south wind, few breaks of Sun, temperatures getting way into the 50s. Of course, we have to get through tonight first. Winter weather advisories in effect for eastern Vermont, northern New Hampshire. As I mentioned, a couple inches of snow possible and a little glaze of freezing rain. But whatever falls tonight doesn't really matter because it's all gone by tomorrow. Temperatures way into the 50s, probably challenging some daily record highs across most of the region. Friday is quiet, but I do want to bring your attention to Saturday. We've got this little system that comes to the south, gets close enough to give us some widespread light snow across the entire region, mostly in central southern Vermont. Looks like a couple inches are possible that day. We'll have a snowfall map for you tomorrow. And then as we think about next week, the week of Christmas, much colder. Highs in the 20s and 30s. Back to you. All right, Ben, thank you.